Reince Priebus now says the party is firmly behind Donald Trump. Of course, obviously, it isn't, but he did just tell members nothing has changed after video surfaced of Trump bragging about groping women. Priebus, though, of course, is the same man who responded to the tape Friday by saying no woman should ever be described in these terms or talked about in this manner ever. And now, of course, people like Paul Ryan have nothing to do with Donald Trump. Dana Bash is out front from Washington. I mean, Dana, it's pretty incredible what's going on here. How is this split happening? Well, let's just start with Reince Priebus. You're right, he was very harsh in his statement uh, on Friday night after this tape came out. He uh, wasn't involved in debate prep as he had been after that. Uh, and more importantly, uh, he and, and sources uh, inside the RNC were making clear if Donald Trump didn't uh, have a good debate yesterday, then they might just completely pull the plug on Republican National Committee resources, which is really huge for a candidate like Donald Trump because he's relying so heavily on the party for money, for get out the vote operations. So much of the grassroots efforts that candidates do, the party is doing this time around. What Reince Priebus told his membership, Aaron, on the phone today was, we've decided nothing has changed. We're still going to back him. His apology was heartfelt. That's what his message was. I can tell you, I'm just going to translate for you now. Donald Trump didn't melt down on the stage. And because of that, uh, Reince Priebus uh, and the RNC feels like they have to stick with him, despite the fact that mm. they certainly were not happy about that tape.